blue. So the slightly greener method by Tanya Harris. Um, detoxify your home is easier, faster, and less expensive than you think. So, sorry. She goes through different like terms, keywords that you would see like pop up um, throughout like food and cosmetic. Um, weight products and other stuff around your that you would like bring into your home for like eating, cleaning, storing, or whatever. Um, studies, statistics, um, and other information are mentioned throughout the book. Um, and you get like tip boxes as well, like um, a, a little extra bits of information or like um, a DIY type of thing. Um, there is a chapter where she does have like DIYs and then a, a chapter of like alternatives um, to use. So um, she like goes through like what causes um, the toxin and other ingredients, um, how they're, they affect your home, yourself, your kids, whatever. Um, and she does like help with um, like information about like how to um, shop greener. Um, and then like she gets, gives bits of information like if not everybody in your household is that on board at first. Small steps like she she's like. Um, it's not going to be overnight an overnight flip. It'll take time. You'll mess up and everything. Um, it's a good book for wanting those facts and um, ideas to have. Um, and Appendix A and um, A, you get different resources of um, and it's categorized. And you get like websites, stores, uh, um, like shops mentioned and B is like a little cheat sheet, cheat sheet section like quick references of like stuff that's mentioned um, throughout the book so um, part one goes into like the home part two eating three cosmetics and then four um, cleaning um, so like in her story and um, like what you need to know about toxins, like what are they, um, and like define your why of wanting to be a uh, greener home, um, three tips to becoming slightly greener, greener. Memorize your deal breakers, the 80-20 rule, find your top two, um, how toxins build in your body. So, um, example of like box type of thing, that's a little quick one. Understanding like different terms like on like labels and stuff like cage-free eggs. Um, you get other names for sugar so you get a list of stuff um, talks about like MSG um, B, BHA and BHT antioxidant preservatives why can't I talk today but um, both used in food um, so, and sometimes you get the boxes one right after the other, each other, um, cast iron cookware tips, um, pantry clean out, so like, a bit of, like, one way to help you out doing that, um,
the power of small changes to your beauty routine. Um, indoor air quality, so she talks about that. So like indoor air quality can be just as bad as like the quality at like outside. So like um, natural ways to help the air quality there. So like um, kind of like DIYs and she does go into like when DIY isn't an option. Um, like when you should be doing like certain cleanings and everything whether it's a daily a weekly or quarterly type of thing so it's a very helpful book you get a lot of information but it's nicely explained explained enough that you're not like having to read it like several times to try and somewhat or barely understand it you do get an understanding of these terms and you do get ideas um, of like small changes that you could make. You don't have to do drastic changes and that's what she's saying. You don't have to make these drastic overnight changes. It's just small swaps here and there that can make a gradual ch um, difference. So for those wanting that backup of like information and facts, um, and um, information and things to do yourself. Um, this is a very um, good book to have as a resource. So the slightly greener method, happy readings.